Hey boys and girls, this book is called Respect the Rules. And we have been talking about rules and we read a book called Who Makes the Rules and now we're gonna talk about respecting the rules. And this book is by Gail Scrabeck Hennessy and it's part of the Primary Source Readers series that we're using in social studies. We're gonna open up the book and we're gonna see the title page Respect the rules. And we're gonna open up to the table of contents and this is gonna tell us our subject headings, our chapter headings, and where we would find those. What is a rule? Page four. Rules are important, page six. Who makes rules? Page 10. Follow the rules, page 12. It is golden, page 16. Show respect, page 18. List it, page 20. Glossary, page 22. And remember, a glossary tells us what the definition of our vocabulary words are in this book. Index, page 23. Your turn, page 24. Okay, I'm gonna open up this book to page four. And the title of this chapter says, What is a rule? Rules tell us what we may and may not do. Rules should be equal. And here is a parenthesis telling us how to sound out this word, equal, for all people. And we have a picture of a boy, he's looking at a list of rules. Looks like he's going to the pool. And the caption says, a boy reads the rules at the pool. Lots of rules there to be safe at the pool. The Constitution. The Constitution, Constitution, is a list of rules for the United States of America. And the caption here says, United States Constitution. This is a picture of our Constitution. Rules are important. Rules protect us. They keep us safe. They help us work together. So here's a chart with a list of rules. The title says rules. Be prepared. Be respectful. Raise your hand. No cheating. Try your best. These rules help kids work together at school. And here's a picture of uh, kids crossing the street. They're using the crosswalk. Walk. They're walking in the crosswalk. They're not running. The crossing guard has the stop sign up stopping traffic. The crossing guard helps the kids cross the street safely. They are following the rules. Without rules, people might make bad choices. Cars might not stop at red lights. People might fight. Drawing on a wall is a bad choice. So you can tell by the look on her face that she's made a bad choice and she got caught because she's writing on the wall. And probably somebody said, what are you doing? And she turned around like, I just got caught. She's making a bad choice. Fighting is a bad choice too. So you can see these kids are fighting over who gets the jar of cookies. Looks like a jar of animal cookies and they both want it and they're fighting. Who makes rules? Principals make rules for schools. Teachers make rules for classrooms. Parents make rules for homes. So here's a picture of some kids it looks like with their teacher at school. And the caption says, the teacher tells the rules to her class. Over here on page 11, we have a picture of the United States Capitol building and it says rules for our country. Government, government leaders make rules for our country. These rules are called laws. 
This is the Capitol Hill in Washington, D.C. It is where government leaders make the rules for our country. Page 12 says, follow the rules. Who makes sure we follow the rules? Parents do. Teachers do. The police do. And here's a picture of a police officer. And the caption says, this police officer makes sure people follow the rules. And here's a picture of an old time schoolhouse. These teachers make sure their students follow the rules in 1940. When we do not follow a rule, there is a consequence, consequence, or result. We learn to follow the rules next time. And the caption right here says, this girl did not follow the rules. She has to stay after class. Good job. When you follow the rules in school, you may earn rewards. So it looks like Brooke got three stars. Tim got three stars. Ryan got one star. And this person, uh, I think her name might be Meg, got two stars. Brooke has earned three stars. Good job, Brooke. It is golden. The golden rule is very old. It says to treat others the way you want to be treated. This girl helps a friend who is hurt. So she's helping her friend because if she was hurt, she would want her friend to help her. So she's doing uh, a nice thing for him and she's hoping that when she needs help, he will do a nice thing for her. Blanket donations. This boy collects blankets to give to people in need. So he's collecting blankets for people who don't have blankets who might be cold. Show respect. When you follow the rules, you show respect. Respect. You show respect for yourself. You show respect for others. Kids can show respect by waiting in line. Students wait in line in 1936. So this is a long time ago. They're waiting in line. Looks like for lunch. And right here looks like a more current time. They're waiting in line for their lunch, but they're all showing respect because they're waiting their turn. List it. Think about the rules you have at home. Talk about the rules with your family. Make a list of rules. Find a place to hang your list to help. Everyone remember the rules. So it looks like this family is working together to make a list of rules. And the caption says, this family writes a list of rules. And this might be the rules that they wrote. It says, family rules. Number one, respect each other's property. Number two, conserve energy in our home. Number three, show good manners. Number four, make chores fun. Number five, pick up after your mess. Number six, compliment each other and number seven listen to each other and it looks like they had a line down at the bottom where they all signed and the caption says this is a family's list of rules and now we're on to the glossary the glossary lists the words that um, are vocabulary words in this book that you might not know it. it's going to tell you what the definition is consequence a result Equal means the same. Golden rule, a rule that says to treat others the way you want to be treated. Government, a group of people who make choices for our country. Laws, a set of rules made by a government. Protect, to keep safe. Respect, the way you show that someone or something is important. Rules, things that tell what you may 
or may not do. And on page 23 is the index, and this is where you can find these words in the book. Choice is on page 8 and 9. Consequence is on page 14. Constitution is on page 5. Government is on page 11. Laws is on page 11. The word respect is on page 18. Look at how many pages the word rules is on. Rules is on page 4 through 6, page 8, page 10 through 12, page 14 through 16, page 18, page 20, and page 24. And the golden rule is mentioned on page 16. Your turn! My class rules. This teacher is telling her class about rules. What rules do you have in your class? Talk to a friend about your class rules and write them down. All right, boys, I've enjoyed reading this book, Respect the Rules with You, and I hope you guys always respect the rules wherever you are, whether at school or at home or in your community.